Welcome to Haltech Elite Training Part 26. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at our nitrous control. We're going to have a lot to learn, so let's get started. All right, so let's jump into this video and talk about working with our nitrous control and our Haltech ESP software. So if we want to spray nitrous, we need to go in and pull some ignition timing and add fuel if we're on a dry kit. If we're on a wet kit, then we definitely need to pull ignition timing. So Haltech has a pretty awesome strategy for nitrous control. We're going to be finding we have four stages of nitrous that we can control. We can control the purging, we can do an interrupt button, we can do a momentary override button to jump to the next stage of nitrous. There's gonna be a tremendous amount of flexibility that we have in the software. So I'm gonna be walking you through looking how to set up different features with the nitrous control so we understand how it works if we're using a wet or a dry kit with nitrous. So without further wait, let's jump in so we can check this out. All right, so let's get started here. We're gonna be taking a look at working with our nitrous control in our Haltech ESP software. We're gonna be finding that this is extremely configurable. So there's gonna be so many options to go and set up and configure. I'm gonna be showing you how I would personally go in and utilize this nitrous feature. We're gonna have some flexibility in the programming. So if you find that maybe this isn't going to suit your needs, you're gonna understand how this works and have a page template that's gonna be used for nitrous control and nitrous tuning. And you're gonna understand how it's gonna work and you can implement your own strategy that you find that's gonna work best for your application. So the first thing we need to do is jump up into our setup here. We're going to be going in in our search results. We're going to be typing in nitrous here and we're going to be finding when we do that, we have all of these different fields that appear here for our nitrous. We can find we have a nitrous enable, a nitrous override, nitrous pressure, and nitrous stage. So we're going to be seeing we have six stages of nitrous control. So we could theoretically have six different relays that we could be turning on or six different nitrous solenoids we could be turning on and adding nitrous as we get uh, going down the racetrack or however we're trying to spray the nitrous. So we have a bunch of flexibility that we're going to be seeing here. Um, so I'm going to be going first and assuming that we're going to be wiring in your nitrous with an enable switch. So when we turn a toggle switch on in the dash, that's going to be telling the Haltech that we're ready to start spraying nitrous. This is how I always set my nitrous control up. We have some other options, but I think this makes the most sense. So the very first thing I'm going to do here is go into Nitrous Enable 1. I'm going to be clicking this. We're going to be seeing we have to go here and edit an assignment. It's showing us it's an error here. We have to go and assign it to an input pin. So in this situation, I always try to use my Sync Pulse inputs or my SPI inputs. If I jump into Edit Connection, we see we have SPI 3, 